Hey guys, Aaron Crow again here with ScareDog.com. Today I'm going to show you how to do a marquee scrolling text for your Flash project. Again, for those of you that might have moved your workspace around or closed some items, and it doesn't exactly look quite like mine, go up here and select Window, go to Workspace, select Reset Essentials, that should put everything back to normal for you. First thing you want to do is come over here and select your text tool. I have Classic Text selected, Static Text, you select whatever font, whatever style, whatever size, and whatever color. Don't forget in CS5 to select embed. Select uppercase, lowercase, numerals, and punctuation. Select OK. You want to left click and drag your text area out here on the canvas. And this is the text I want to scroll. Okay, put whatever text you want here. Next we want to figure out what position we want our text to scroll in. Let's say you want it to scroll there at the bottom, or you want there to scroll there in the middle like I'm going to do with mine. Just position it right there and select F8. We're going to convert this to a symbol type of movie clip. I'm going to name mine scroll text. Tell it OK. And we're going to double click and go inside of our scroll text symbol here. I'm going to left click and I'm just going to drag it off of the canvas there. In this area you're going to have to play around with a little bit depending on how fast or how slow you want the text to scroll. I figure around 200, let's just tell you what, let's just say 250 just to be safe. We're going to select around there, just left click, then right click that area, select insert keyframe. Now with the last keyframe selected, I'm going to hold down my shift key, and then left click and drag this over to the other side where it's off the canvas again. Then here in this gray area I'm going to right click and I'm going to select create classic tween. And what that's going to do is that's going to create the scroll effect that we want here. So come up here in the upper left hand corner and select scene 1. Go to control test scene and there you go there's a text that we want to scroll now for those of you that might have selected a different speed or a different keyframe there just want to show you the last thing we can do is we can come over here and we select that last keyframe we can either shorten it or you can extend it come up here to scene Select Control, Test Scene. And you just play around with it and see how fast or how slow you want it to scroll. Once again, guys, Aaron Crow again here with ScareDog.com. Look forward to your comments.